Hey, welcome back to Skies of Arcadia. So, I still haven't found that moonfish. Doesn't beep anymore when I walk around here. That's annoying. Ah, yeah, this guy's clearly doing, clearly having fun. I can't get up there yet. A dabu. You can dismount wherever you see red poles. Well, I'd like to think I could dismount wherever I wanted, really. This guy obviously has something to say. There's that moonfish. He wants to basically just punch through the great gates himself. He's crazy. He's flipped. Armor. More armor. Ooh. Lowers defense. Boosts attack power and spirit. Not sure I like that so much. Can you wear it? Yeah. Oh, that's a huge boost for everything of you. Yeah. I'm glad I didn't buy you equipment earlier on. Give me back my Dabu. My Abu Dabu. See what I did there? I made a pun on a place name. Can I? Oh, I can do that. Stop being such a pain in my ass. I don't know how to get that one. Oh. Okay. That's how. Moonfish. Moon. Slipara. A spell that puts people to sleep. Okay, now I think we've done. Aside from getting that chest in there, which we can't do just yet, I think we've done everything in this side of the area. This side of the area, this side of the city. Can I? Is there something up there worth getting? I don't think so. But I'm gonna have a look just in case. A red herring. A red herring at the red pool. Oh. There's a nifty little idea this whole um, riding a dabu across the desert thing. It'd be nice if you could explore a bit more. It'd be nice if it wasn't such a pain in the ass. Something down there to explore. And something back there to get. Three hundred gold, always handy. Helps to have some money. Get on the bloody thing. My question is in this: Where are Ike and Fina? Oi, move it, kid. He's got expectations, so that's the inn where I go to continue this story. 
But I got some exploration to do. I don't want anything to do with fortune tellers. And nope. Clearly, there's something to do down here, so let's go have a look. I think this is a combat area as well, so I come across enemies. takes me up to that other chest I think. Be handy if I could actually use this method of getting across. I can't get out of here. Another moonberry. Fantastic. Nobody else can learn anything yet for a while. May as well learn Lunar Glyph. puzzle around here to get all the items. Obviously as we open one set of gates another will close. Let's quickly familiarise ourselves with everything around here. Guess I was wrong about this being a combat area. I can't fight anything here. Excavation arm. That'll be for Drachma later on. A clue that he will be coming back. Come on, camera! Play ball. Thank you. Gem of fluidity. What is that? Defense, magic, defense. Protects against being stoned. Not that kind of stoned. Doesn't boost magic defense that much. Then she has got one that boosts boost it by the power of 21. Oh, I might just sell that. I think that's actually all there is down here. Just. Just the two items. Plus the one up there. I remember this being a lot more confusing when I was younger. Again, I was young. I wasn't very good at puzzles or anything like that. the confusing part. Hmm, actually. Oh, 
look at the map. When I press this, does the map change to reflect what's open and closed? No, it doesn't. Okay. Well, that was a fun little excursion. Kind of hoping it was a combat area because, again, Fina really needs to level up a bit. Now, does she not look familiar? You know, it seems uh, it seems we've seen her face before. I wonder what Vice is doing. <laughs> hey, hey what, what's up, what is up with her neck? That is just not right. That is not right. You play it off, Vice. <laughs> Zooming in. <laughs> We've got a love four sided shape. Love rhombus going on here. Who knows where she's been? Right behind you. Have you cottoned on to who she is yet? I'm not going to spoil the surprise if you haven't gotten on to who she is. Of course, Dave will know who she is. I assume you're still watching this, Dave. But that's because, like me, Dave has played this game to death. He knows how it goes. Now, now that I think about it, this is one of the few JRPGs I've actually completed. I have a tendency to start them and never finish them. I made life really difficult for myself because I went into the final battle really low level. Okay. Spend the night.
A special rate on our room. Who's paying it? That's a very dangerous place to be sailing, Drachma, so close to those rocks. You haven't second thoughts, old man. What's that? Parked among the reefs? By now you guys have probably cottoned on to what's going on. Uh, my first playthrough I never did. Not until the big reveal. See if you guys can... I mean, I've probably... You, now that you know something is going on, you can probably work it out. Bye, Inkeep. Let's quickly save. Another difference between this and Grandia. In Grandia 2, at the save points, there's also a chance to freely recover your health and mana and all that jazz. You get that option here. Ica doesn't trust her. Well. I mean, it's a reasonable question. I mean, that doesn't make much sense. Uh, you need to get to this random temple to do something. So because I hate war, you can use my ship. Eh? <laughs> I think there's a discovery around here too we can get. I think it's actually on this. Maybe I'm wrong. Is it in here? Oh well, we'll have a fight while we look for it. And of course, now we only start fights with four spirit. A yellow affiliated. It's 
should probably switch some to blue actually because water magic is going to be quite good in here. Oh, good going, Vice. Quite strong. That's really strong. Don't do that. We won! We won! We did! We did! Fina took one hit and nearly died. Huh? I think she's leveling up quickly. Everyone's close to learning blue magic. So while I remember, let's A heal Fina and B switch you to blue. Desert was the true treasure. Yeah, that didn't happen. Desert is the true treasure, my foot. You know what? You guard. Ah. You guys aren't very strong, that's good. Well, they're, they're strong ish, as in, got good attack, poor defense. No! Don't you freaking. No! That's that spell! Instant death! New plan. Kill these guys. ASAP. Yeah. I can see why that spell is a colossal pain. Ah. Fatigued? That's another uh, debuff. So Vice won't recover spirit. Easy way of reviving Fina. That wasn't so bad. I think I have some Rizalem crystals sitting around, but I really don't want to use them outside. So just have to sit out this round of experience. Man, that went south really quickly, didn't it? The good news is that. She instantly re revives outside of battle. Hope I have enough Sacri Crystals. East. Right. Hang on. Map is what I need. Yeah, up there I need to go.
go. Please, no more fights until we get inside. There we go. And also kinds of the discovery. Pretty impressive structure, isn't it? And is it just me or those things look like they got faces? Wow. Oh. You got a hole to dig yourself out of. there's anything I can any chest or anything outside I definitely don't think there's any charms or anything but it never hurts to explore Next time on Skies of Arcadia, we're getting all up inside this thing. See you next time.